In the highly anticipated fifth phase of the Lok Sabha election on Monday, 14 critical parliamentary seats in Uttar Pradesh, including the high-profile constituencies of Raibareli, Amethi and the state capital Lucknow will go to the polls. A total of 49 seats across six states and two main union territories will be contesting in this phase. Among the 14 seats in Uttar Pradesh, the Bharatiya Janta Party is aiming to replicate its impressive 2019 performance where it secured victory in 13 out of these 14 seats, with Rai Bareli being the only exception won by Congress, Songunia Gandhi. Gandhi Family Bashan Rai Bareli and Amiti have long been strongholds of the Gandhi family. Sonia Gandhi, the then Congress chief, won the Rai Bareli seat in the last election. However, her son Rahul Gandhi faced a surprising defeat in Amethi against Union Minister Smriti Rani. This time, Rahul Gandhi is contesting from Rai Bareli, facing BJP State Minister Dinesh Pratap Singh. In Amethi, Congress has fielded Kail Sharma, a loyalist of the Gandhi family, against Smriti Rani. Capital Contest in Uttar Pradesh capital Lucknow, Union Defence Minister Rajnath Singh is seeking a third consecutive term. Lucknow, once represented by former Prime Minister Atal Bihari Vajpayee, has been a BJP stronghold since 1991. Rajnath Singh will be up against Ravi Das Meherotra of the Samajwadi Party and Sarwar Malik of the Bahujan Samaj Party. Significance of Uttar Pradesh With 80 Lok Sabha seats at stake, Uttar Pradesh is pivotal for BJP's goal of securing 400 seats in the parliament. The BJP won 162 seats in the state in 2019 and 71 in 2014. The Congress is contesting in Uttar Pradesh in alliance with Samajwadi Party. 41 seats in Uttar Pradesh will be up for grabs in the remaining three phases of the elections. Key contest in other constituencies. Kasar Ganj, represented by the controversial MP and former Wrestling Federation of India President Brit Bhushan Saran Singh, who is facing serious allegation of sexual harassment, BJP has fielded his son Karan Bhushan Singh against SP's Bhagat Ram Mishra and BSP's Narendra Pandey. Muhalal Ganj, Union Minister Kaushal Kishore is seeking his third term, contending with SP's RK Chaudhary and BSP's Rajesh Kumar. Jhansi, former Union Minister Pradeep Jain Aditya of Congress is up against sitting BJP MP Anurag Sharma with BSP's Ravi Prakash Maurya also in the fray. Jalaon, Union Minister Bhanu Pratap Singh Verma seeks his sixth term, challenged by first-time candidate from SP and BSP. Hamirpur, Sitting BJP MP Pushpendra Singh Chandel is vying for a third term with SP's Ajendra Singh Rajput as his main opponent. Banda, BJP's RK Singh Patel is challenged by SP's Krishna Devi Patel and BSP's Mind Divedi. Patepur, Union Minister Sadhvi Niranjan Jyoti seeks a third term facing SP's Naresh Uttam Patel. Kaushambhi, BJP's Vinod Shonkar is seeking a third term against SP's Pushpendra Saroj. Parabanki, a direct contest between BJP's Raj Rani Rawat and Congress Tanuj Punia. Fazabad, sitting BJP MP Lalu Singh is challenged by Samajwadi Party's Avdesh Prasad. Gonda, BJP's Kirti Vardhan Singh faces SP's Shreya Verma, making her a political debut. The fifth phase of the Lok Sabha election in Uttar Pradesh promises to be a decisive battle with high stakes for all major parties. The result of these 14 seats will significantly impact the overall outcome of the general election, making this phase one to watch out closely. With Kaya person Gaurav this is Tapush Bhattacharya for TD India from Uttar Pradesh.